guys! So today I'm going to be doing a haul video for you guys because who doesn't love hauls? Actually, a lot of people don't like hauls. I'm gonna do one anyways. So it is back to school season, so a lot of people are doing retail therapy. I mean, back to school shopping. So I just wanted to show you guys some of the things that I got and yeah, let's just get started. So the first thing I got are some candles from Bath and Body Works because back to school means fall time and fall time means yummy delicious smelling candles from Bath and Body Works for 2 for $24. By the way, I remember when it used to be 2 for 20 all the time and now it's 2 for 24 and I feel really cheated on. I love Bath and Body Works fall candles and I love their winter candles even more and I'm just so excited. Fall and winter time are my favorite seasons ever. This is the best time of the year. Um, but the first candle I got is this. It is the pumpkin cupcake and it says satisfy your sweet tooth with the scent of a freshly baked pumpkin cupcake covered in loads of rich buttercream frosting. I'm hungry. Oh, it smells so good. Hmm. The next thing I got is a cult favorite and you have to get it every single year and you have to get multiple. This is like one of the five I'm getting this year. Celebrate this. Ugh. Can't read. Celebrate the brilliant colors of autumn with this rich blend of golden nectar, red apple, and spiced berries. Ooh, it smells like everything fall and you put it in a candle. It's like a house of wax, kind of. Like you just took everything of fall, turned that into wax, and made it into a candle. Graphic? Yeah. Too far? Yeah. Typical? The next thing I got is this body butter from the body shop and it is the strawberry body butter because with fall time comes dry skin and nobody wants ashy skin, okay? That ain't cute. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Guys, it smells like strawberry shortcake, like the cartoon character, chewing loads of strawberry bubble gum, the ones that you get at an Asian market, the one that comes in like a little box and it comes in fours. If you know what I'm talking about, like this video because you're freaking awesome. And then you kind of just blended her in a blender and then like created her into a body butter. That was probably too graphic. The next thing I got is from Lush. So the first thing I got, I don't really know what it's called, but it's uh, like a macaroon body thing. It looks like this. It's like a rose uh, butter with coconut in the middle. I don't smell the coconut, I just smell rose. Mmm, smells so good. Next thing I got, I do know what it's called. It's called Dragon's Egg. And the person told me that this is like the most like extravagant one. Mmm, it smells so good. It smells clean but fruity at the same time. Kind of like you bleached some fruit and you turned it into a dragon's egg. So good. And now there's white powder all over me which kind of looks like cocaine. Now moving on to makeup. I didn't get that much makeup. I just got two things. I got this. It is the Nude by The Bomb. It's an eyeshadow palette. It's a nude eyeshadow palette. Don't want to blind you guys. And it comes with 12 eyeshadows. It has a lot of colors and perfect for fall because it does have some like dark plummy colors and some shimmery colors and it's a mix of shimmery and matte so that's awesome next thing from the bomb i got this it is the mary luminizer and i have been obsessed with this lately not only do i use this as a highlighter for my cheeks have you can you guys tell can you guys tell i overused highlighter to like fake a good glow right here but not only have i been using it as a highlighter i've also been using it as an eyeshadow so it does a double job which is great now moving on to actual clothes. I'm going to show you guys some of the jewelry I got first just to get that out of the way. So the first thing I got is from Forever 21 and it is this necklace. I really love long chain necklaces, especially if it's gold. So I got this long chain necklace and it has like these uh, spiky things pointing down and there's four of them. And I think it's just super cute. Next, ne oh, next necklace that's kind of hard to say. Next necklace I got. Did I say that right? Oh my gosh. Next necklace I got is also from Forever 21. I got all my jewelry from Forever 21. It is this super big state. It's not super big. It's a statement necklace though. It's bigger than what I typically wear. I usually like to wear very long chain, very dainty necklaces. But this one's short and it's just really big. And I love the colors with this. It has like a creamy and then like a diamond color and then a navy blue and then a light blush pink color. And I think you can just dress this up with any outfit if you wear like a white chiffon top with some black jeans. I think it'd be so cute. So I got that. Speaking of long chain dangly dainty necklaces, I got this one. It is a three tier necklace and it's really really thin and very long and it has kind of like these 
geos on the end of two of them and just a plain one right here but let me tell you this gets tangled super easily and i'm being so careful with it final thing i got from forever 21 jewelry wise is this watch i love rose gold watches so i got a big one and i think it looks great but this is really pretty and i love it Moving on to Hollister, I only got one thing from Hollister and that is some jeans. I needed new jeans and they have some distressing here and on the knee right here and some on the top and this is what the butt looks like. It's just a plain Hollister thing and it is a little bit too big for me because Hollister was having a sale. It was like all of their jeans are $25 but because of that all of my sizes were pretty much gone so these are a little bit too big for me but I'm going to work with it. Wear some night, wear a belt with it, you know, it will be okay. Moving on to mango, I only got one thing and my hanger is broken, but we're just going to ignore that. Um, I got this sweater, and I think this is so cute. It's a white and navy blue sweater, and it's striped from the bottom down. Moving on to Nike, because I love Nike so much. The first thing I got are these running shoes, because I do love running and working out in general. So, I got these running shoes because my running shoes were just destroyed, gave me blisters, made me bleed. So, I got some nicer running shoes. These are the Nike Free Ones 5.0 and they are the blue ones because I love blue. And again, I tend to wear a lot of black and white, so having a pop of color is great. And then the next thing from Nike is this windbreaker. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this. It's black and white. This will be perfect because in Seattle, it does tend to rain a lot and it's very windy. So the fact that this is like waterproof and it's a windbreaker, it's just great. And I've already worn this once. Moving on to Aeropostale, I got this really really big knit cardigan that is a maroon color i don't know how it's showing up on camera but it is a very dark maroon color and i love it so much i wanted to get this in a like a light cream color but they didn't have it at the store i went to so i was like okay so i ended up getting the maroon which is actually perfect because i love maroon moving on to forever 21 i think that's all i have left is Forever 21. I did a lot of shopping there. The first thing I got are these shoes that I've already worn, so they're kind of dirty on the bottom, but it is these light tan color, and they're slightly heeled, which is great because I am on the shorter side, so it just adds a little bit of height to me without adding too much so my feet don't hurt throughout the like school day and it's just great and it's like you can wear it casual but you can also dress it up and it's just so cute i wore it all of yesterday and i love it next thing i got are these pants these are just plain black pants nothing much to say about them that's it moving on i got this uh uh sleeveless strapless strapless romper and it's this really pretty print and it just defines my style. I love these kinds of prints. And it comes with pockets and it's great. What it looks like. This is what the print looks like. It is a black kimono with some aztec uh prints going vertically. And I think it's just super cute. And I can't get enough of kimonos. I have so many. But, you know, science. Next thing I got is the same print as, like, my other dress but this one has like sleeves on it and I think it's just super cute the print is slightly different it's a little bit more going on and it's a little bit more of like a nudie color than anything else and it just looks like this it's a dress not a romper but like I like this part but then if you look at the back it kind of has a slightly cut it out who ever thought to name this spaghetti straps I don't know and then the final things that I got are all flannels I have a problem so the first flannel I got is this one it is this like very dark uh ready wine color with black flannel and I don't have many like darker flannels I have a lot of like ones that are mainly on like the brighter side next flannel I got is again on the lighter side because that's I don't know science it is this one and it's like a dark plummy red with black and it's really really long so I can wear this with like leggings and some combat boots and call it good and then the final thing I got is a flannel dress. I've never, ever, ever tried a flannel dress before, but I wanted to kind of see how I can style it and make it really cute. And that's what it looks like. And I hate myself filling, filling, filming hauls because the only thing I can think of, like the only adjective I can think of is, oh, it's super cute. And yeah.
So that is it for my haul video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Give it a thumbs up if you guys did. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for a new video every week. And that is it for this video. And I will see you guys in my next one next week. Bye.